So let's so let's deep that. Let's get, let's get back into you know your story. So how did you get into MMA? MMA. So uh, I had just did my financial aid for school, and I was you know getting ready to go to Henry Ford, and my financial aid got messed up somehow. So one of my buddies kept on hitting me up like you know come check out the gym, come check out our gym. And I didn't know what MMA was at the time either. I was an 18-year-old kid, just graduated high school, uh, had my little summer job going, whatever. Buddy kept telling me, come check out my MMA gym. You know, we we got we over here getting work in, man. We would love to have you. And eventually, when I didn't get into school, I just was like, all right, I'll go check it out. I ain't doing nothing else with my time. This, <laughs> that, that's, that's, that, it, it sounds simple, but that's what it was. And I, was, I walked into that gym and... Uh, Man, they offered to let me do free training. They was like, listen, man, you athletic. You know, we'd love to have you a part of the team. You come in here this many days a week, and you can train for free. And I was wow. like, say say less, right? <laughs> say less. So I so I, I jumped on that opportunity, man, and I, uh, I started training. The next semester of school came around. Financial aid got messed up again, man. Uh, but, so it sounded like it was meant, man. But, it sounded like it was meant. <laughs> I took my first fight after that. I took my first fight, and... Uh, Bam, knocked a guy out in 60 seconds. Mm. And uh, from that moment forth, I was like, this is what I'm about to do. <laughs> this is what I'm about to yeah, do. Definitely. I, I fell in love with the feeling off bail, off bail. You know, I ended up going 3 4 and 0, you know, all knockouts. And then I held the champion, my amateur first amateur title. And I just was in it. I was in it at that point. It wasn't no turning back for me. Nice. What, what gym did you start out training with? Training with? Courageous MMA. It no longer exists, but that that gym, that gym could have been at the top of the mat for sure. It, it was a badass gym. We had so many bodies in there. A lot of the top guys in the state was there at the time. We had some good ass coaches. Um, even the promoter for WXC was training out of that gym with us. Wow. Yeah. So it was. It was that gym was legit. You know, I, I missed the gym actually. I missed the gym. I wish that it was still here. If it was still here, I would still be there. For sure. For sure. Not to not to impugn the gyms that I've trained out of or the gym that the gyms that I'm at right now. That was you know, your I, first love. That was my first love for sure. And it was a good ass gym. That's where you jumped off the portrait. <laughs> exactly. <laughs>